the more responsibility we have, the more power we exercise. It comes with huge responsibility and equally major accountability. There are inbuilt mechanisms in the Constitution to take care of any situation if we properly interpret the Constitution, we can be able to take care of any excesses by whatever office holder. And therefore, for us to be a country built on the firm foundation of the rule of law, we must always keep to that narrow path of the rule of law and avoid extra constitutional, extra legal means of dealing with one another. It points clearly and squarely that uh, if any arm of government, including the hallowed judiciary, go beyond the law, go beyond the constitution, there is a mechanism for necessary corrective measures that can be done. It is therefore absolutely not necessary to lynch any public officer in the court of public opinion or in any other place. If we have issues with anybody in whatever office, we just need to follow the law, we just need to stick to the constitution, and we can sort out whatever issues that we have with uh, whatever public officer that uh, we believe is not acting in accordance with the mandate or the constitution or the law for that matter. So again, um, this is yet another step as a country that we are building on the firm foundation of the rule of law, uh, sticking to the dictates of uh, what our constitution and the law provides in dealing with whatever uh, issues that arise in our society. And again, let me congratulate the tribunal for discharging this heavy responsibility in a timely manner. And uh, your presentation of this uh, report, I think brings to the end your responsibility. And uh, myself and others will take it up from there and also discharge our responsibility accordingly. So again, congratulations to all of you. Thank you very much for the service you have provided to the country, discharging your constitutional and legal mandate over this matter. I will uh, subsequently do my part as instructed by you. <laughs> this is a matter that I do not have any other recourse. And uh, I don't believe that if a matter like this comes to my office, and I have no choice but to do what the law says, that does not make me any less. I think it's just the way things are supposed to be. I think there is an argument always as to whether the president can be presented with a fait accompli. And, and I think there are occasions that uh, that's the case, and I think this is one of them. I, I will not try to do anything other than what the Constitution expects of me. So, and I think that's how we should look at uh, things as, as a country and as a, and as a society. So again, uh, to all of you, Asante Nisana, Nawatakia Heri, in your other assignments, and uh, I hope to uh, work with you going into the future on other matters. Asante Nisana.